Hey guys, Lyra Lynx here, and today I am back with another card pack opening video. I picked up two Sword and Shield packs at Walmart, just the normal 10 additional game card packs. And then while I was going through the Dollar Tree the other day, I had a couple more dollars to spend, and I just got these three additional packs of the Sword and Shield that they just got in. So, I thought I would do an opening video now that I have a couple of them and it's a little more interesting. So I decided to separate it as its own video rather than just doing it in a vlog like I have been doing with the little packs. I think I'm going to open these first. So, I'm going to tap into Zation here. So we're already starting off pretty decently, in my opinion. Here we have Silicobra. I really like the art here for this. And I'm excited to get some new stuff. Ooh. Here we have Dredna. Awesome. He's a cutie. I love him. And Ferrothorn. Not really a Pokemon I'm super into, but he's alright. <laughs> Alright, and then I just have one more of these little three-pack ones, so... <gasps> yes! We get to start off with my baby. Snom. I love Snom so much. I feel like... <laughs> I feel like I just really like all the super popular Pokémon from this region and nothing else. Honestly, this region was a little bit make or break for me, Galar. And uh, a lot of Pokemon have grown on me, but at first I wasn't feeling it. And I guess we'll see, really, once I get all the way through Pokemon Shield. But Snom is so adorable. This art style is kind of like, eh, but I still love it just because of Snom. Okay, I've got my first starter here. I guess Grookey chose me, even though I chose Sobble. Very cute. And a Hyper Potion, which leads, finally, into these packs. I think I'm going to open up the Zation one first and then save Lapras for last. And here I go. Boom. And this is still completely intact. Not that I save them anymore. I actually used to save these a lot, and I would, like, hang them up in my room or just present them somewhere. Every now and again, I'll save one of these just... For like the look of it because I think it's cool but I don't do that as much anymore though my friend did give me a couple of like the Pokemon boxes that you see in like the store promoting a product that they just throw away otherwise so I have two of those in my room now and I'll have to show those off at some point honestly I think they're really cool but getting back to opening this pack here okay so just like in this first three pack I got a Silicobra, though this one is a different design, so I haven't gotten a copy yet. That's good. I like this one a lot better. He just looks so fierce and upset. I love that. Next up, we have a Pokemon I'm not a huge fan of. Flipbug. I mean, I guess I'm a little bit critical of bug types in general, just because, like, Insects can be kind of creepy for me sometimes. I mean, Pokemon does a decent job of making them cute, but I don't really like this design. Then we have Goldeen, sassy as usual. Aw, next up we have the cutie that I really, really want on my team, Yamper. Honestly, Corgis are just so adorable. I can't help but like Yamper, even though I feel like Yamper is one of those Pokemon that doesn't exactly look like the Pokemon style. And then we have Skaroopy, a very beloved Pokemon of mine from Snow. Ooh, it's my girl! I got a hollow of my girl! Inteleon. So, I knew from the beginning that I wanted Sobble, because Sobble was a cutie. The evolutions kind of make, made, were gonna like make or break it for me, rather. And at first I was kind of thinking that Cinderace was a little bit cooler, but then Inteleon has grown so much on me. Like, people make fun of her design and they're like, oh, she looks, you know, like promiscuous almost, like, ooh, $20 is $20. No. 
I kind of agreed at first, but now I just really like the spy theme of Inteleon, and I'm so glad that I chose Sobble because I love her so much too now. Alright, and then next up we have Toxicroak. I feel like he is an underrated boy, and Toxicroak deserves way more love. I really like that card. We've got a dark energy. Oh look, it's the venerable bead! <laughs> Alright, I like that. We've got Hitmonlee. I really like the design of this card too. Just off training with Hitmonchan in the distance. And then finally, there's a rare candy. So that is that one. And then finally, I have this Lapras one. And I just hope for more new Pokemon. Honestly, it would be cool. Get a GX or something, or maybe a Sobble card I would really like, but we'll see what's in here. Zamazenta is presented on the front of this. We're starting with a weird type of card for me. I always think it's interesting to look at, but it's also just like strange. It's Muna in like the yarn style. Whenever I see this, it reminds me of like some of the weird imagery that you see in the anime Madoka Magica. But anyway. <laughs> Next up we have a really cute Roselia card. She is like in a little flower shop. It's very nice. Alright, to go with the dreadnought I got, now we have Chewdle, this little toots. He's like so ugly in a way that he's cute. I don't know how to feel about Chewdle to be honest. We get another blip bug. Not impressed, pass. Okay, and then there's Rhyhorn. Come on, I'm wanting some more new Pokemon here. Yes! Okay, we have a Sobble card. So that's exactly what I hoped for. Ooh. Let's go with Inteleon. Now I just need the mid form. Ooh hoo hoo hoo! We've got a good one. Vicatini! <gasps> Full art and everything. Awesome! I love the look of this too. I actually don't know what the V means. There's so much I have to learn about Pokemon. <laughs> as much as I love it and it's been a part of my life for years, things like the card game and IVs and this and that about the games and, and all different franchises, I haven't come to understand all of this yet. Then we have Steel-type Energy and I've got another Hitmonchan. Great ball. Ooh. And to end things off, I've got Galarian Linoon. His design is so funny. I really love it. I mean, so obviously, <laughs> this was clearly the best pull. It's so awesome. I love the way this card looks. This is epic. And then, I also really love Sobble and Inteleon. Toxicroak is a good boy too. Honestly, I'm just really happy to have new stuff. Snom is adorable, and yes. Alright, that was actually really fun for me. I hope that <laughs> in the future I'll be able to get more cards, but that might not be for a little bit yet, so I will just have to take care of the ones that I do have. Alright. That is it for this video. Please be sure to leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe for more content, and I would love to see you in another video. Bye! This is my Goral, and you can't convince me otherwise. Ah, be right back, you guys. I'm getting involved in some shady dealings. <laughs> what are you gonna do when you're living all alone? <laughs> Call for family. <laughs> Why do both of these attacks just sound sexual? What? The nightshade wasn't enough? Have you tried more poison? My poor, innocent baby. Need I say more? I think Ferrothorn is into threesomes. A triple smash, if you will. An energy slap on them hoes.